WrestleCon winding down, and we're here on the Hannibal TV with the old, the one and only Rob Van Dam, RVD. Tell the fans what you've been doing lately. You have any plans on coming back to the ring? Uh, yes, I do. In fact, um, I wrestle for Pacific Coast Wrestling in Los Angeles, and I, I, RVD, am the PCW champion. So I will be returning to defend that. As long as I want to. I wrestled MVP last week. You know MVP. Yes, sir. He came after my PCW championship. And um, I'll be wrestling in August in Australia. So I'm still getting in the ring. I do it just like everything. I do a little of that. I do a little stand-up comedy. I do a little uh, appearances. I do a little acting. But... Most importantly and consistently, I do as little as possible. Absolutely. I love that. I wish I could do that. Most people uh, do. Yes, I, I, I've, I've been getting really good at it. <laughs> I've been focusing on that throughout my whole career. And I almost, I got it down now to where I pretty much pretend I'm retired, except for a few days you here You need to start seminars, because I think they'd sell out, man. We could I, go into business together, me and you. But I've learned that the downside to being RVD is that Nobody understands you. However, totally worth it. <laughs> hey, just real quick, looking back to uh, ECW and what a ride that was for everybody involved. When you look back, what are some of the uh, your favorite memories of the time there? Jeez, uh, I mean, ECW had such a car wreck appeal. I like to, when I'm talking to fans, like, you didn't even have to be a fan. You know, it was like the ring's on fire, the fans are throwing their chairs in, bearing the ring, that kind of stuff. If that doesn't hook you in, when you flip through the channels, we can never be friends because <laughs> that's the kind of stuff that should stick you, stick you on that channel for a bit. But, you know, ECW started everything. I mean, uh, maybe not like the first barbed wire matches, but as far as like the, uh, it, what became the Attitude Era, but you know, Sandman right there, he's smoking Sandman. What the hell? Did Steve Austin copy your cigarettes and beer? No, not cigarettes, but beer, right? The I beer. Think it's a gentleman talking about ECW, who, the who Sandman. Do, who drank beer on the way to the ring first? Sandman or Steve Austin? Uh, it would be Sandman. Yeah, I, yeah, he was all was choked up to see me. The worked was before he went to WWE. We, yeah. me, him and Mikey did like a three-way or something. He's cool shit, though. Did he say, bye, I'm taking your gimmick with me? Uh, hell he, yeah, I'm all taking it. Was, he had a beer after his match. I had a fucking... I, I was doing my whole thing, you know, bleeding before I even got in the ring. So, but, hey, I wasn't the first one to use a cane, you know what I mean? Jojo Yamamoto had one in the ring in the 70s, you know what I mean? So Yes, sir. Well, good to see you, Sandman. Yeah, good, good to see you, Rob. But go on, keep going. No, so, but I was just saying how ECW yes, um, originated a lot of the uh, stuff that we see in mainstream. Wasn't the first barbed wire match, or the first game me, match. Me and Raven, uh, we did our fucking crucifixion angle. Six uh, months later, they're doing the crucifixion angle. Just so like I'm going. sensing a pattern here. We kind of, it kind of went from the RVD 420 to. Uh, you know, uh, what was it uh, Roll Your Dog a Bone and Pim Daddy? It was Godfather and X Pac and all these guys. All Bell Venus, I think. It was cool to talk about marijuana for a little bit of period of time. But anyway, speaking of, <laughs> anyway, uh, I'm very proud to be part of ECW because I've been wrestling for hundreds and hundreds of years. So it's good that I was a pioneer, not just someone going through those times. You certainly were a pioneer, RVD, and. Uh, for the fans who might want to see where you're acting, where you're doing your comedy, uh, or where they can learn how to be and uh, do nothing, uh, yeah. where should they go on social media? The real R V D everywhere. Instagram, you whatever. No Twitter. Make it up. Uh, MySpace, not MySpace. No one does that anymore. What is MySpace? I don't know. The real R V D. Easy to remember. Thank you so much, Rob. Cool, dude. Thank you.